Inteligența artificială ar putea provoca războaie dacă nu se fac reglementări urgente în acest sens, avertizează celebrul profesor de la Universitatea din Oxford, Ian Golding. Am făcut un interviu uh, exclusiv cu profesorul care vorbește și despre riscul pe care îl expune, de pildă, inclusiv Elon Musk, de a pierde foarte multe locuri de muncă în viitorul apropiat, pentru că extinderea inteligenței artificiale ar putea să înlocuiască omul cu mașini. I will be not sure that I'm speaking with Mr. Golding in a few years. Yeah, no, no, I think this is a big threat. Um, maybe it's the biggest threat of this new phase of augmented artificial intelligence is the capacity to do deep fake. People could do that with us. They could take our images and our voices and make us say something completely different to what we're saying now. How do you then tell fact from fiction? And of course, this could create wars. You know, you could, the Chinese generals could see the a U.S. Uh, submarine attacking them, mm -hmm. but it's not really happening. Yeah. Uh, so then they respond, and then you have a, a world war. Uh, so this is, I think, a very, very deep threat. The existential risk is that it's used in these deep fake and other ways to create new conflicts, uh, etc. So I think regulating that, holding people that uh, say lies or use fake Now, the, can we make the platforms responsible for what's on the platforms and say to the platforms, if you spread something which is not true, you, are, you the platform, are lying. Of course, they're saying we can't control what's on our platforms. Um, I say that's your problem, not my problem. <laughs> um, but that, that's, I think, where we're heading, is what is the comeback Yeah, but speaking about the existential risk, uh, one of the, the topics is about losing jobs. If the AI will uh, take place of many and many yes. uh, different kinds of jobs, this means millions of people, or tens of millions or hundreds of millions of people, they will don't have to work, and what will be happened after? Well, this is a very, very important question, and one of my research groups in Oxford is, <coughs> is devoted to just working on this. Uh, question. I think we need to think very carefully about which are the jobs, but where are the jobs? The place. Place is very important. What skills are vulnerable? How can people recreate themselves? The new jobs are not in the same places as the old jobs. So how can people move to where the new jobs are? Can they afford the housing? Is there public transport? These sorts of questions about Some places will be growing very rapidly and other places will be declining. How do you get from the one to the other? Or can you take the new jobs to the old places? These are very important questions. Um, also, how do, we, how do we reward things that are not currently rewarded? So machines will not do many things that humans do now. They will not look, after, they will not look after your children. Uh, your babies. They will not look after your elderly parents. They will not, they will not, we will not go, I think, to a music concert or to the theater or anything. Or we will not go to a restaurant with a machine cooking the food. Okay. It's not going faster and faster, this kind of changes? It's not no, progressive? Yeah. No, there's no progress on machines giving us a massage. You know, in the, in the airports they have chairs which can be on a massage. Those are the same chairs that have been there for 20 years. And I think, I tried them once, I will never try them again. Uh, but a good massage is a good massage monsieur, a good massage therapist, or you, you know, a doctor. So these are things that I believe remain human, that AI can enhance it, but not replace it. But many of them, like caring for children or caring for an elderly person, are not rewarded properly. And so I think we'll change our reward structures as part of this. Uh, those jobs will grow in number. We'll need many more people that do the elderly care. Uh, we'll spend a bigger part of our income on leisure and services. So that will grow.